Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for November 28th of 2021. Well, it is titled a high cliff on comet Sheryumov Gerashmenko. So what do we see here? Well, this is the comet known as Sheryumov Gerashmenko, and it was the comet that was visited by the Rosetta spacecraft and was studied during its last approach back in 2014. And this is one of the images taken very high detailed image showing a very large cliff on this comet. Now the comet is made up of mostly icy material with some rocky material thrown in as well. And we can see some of that material here along this kilometer high cliff. And interestingly, because it is so small, its gravity is very low, meaning you could actually jump off the kilometer high cliff and survive the impact. And that's because the gravity is so low that you would not accelerate near as much as you would here on Earth, for example. Now, the icy material is what vaporizes when it comes close to the sun and is what we then see as the comet. When we see a head of a comet with its tail sticking back, that's what we normally see here from Earth. However, when we look up close at the comet nucleus, as we do here, we get to get a better way to be able to study objects like this. And that's something that we have not been able to do until the last couple of decades when we have been able to fly by some comet nuclei and be able to get our first look up close at what these objects are. Now comets themselves have been known since ancient times and every decade or so we get a very bright comet that is easily visible to the naked eye. Now this comet is not one of those although it's just passed its closest to Earth you still need a small telescope to be able to see it. So it's not one of the brighter comets but it is one that has now been the best studied and given us our most uh, up to date information on comets and how they work. So future missions will be able to build on this and to study other comets to start to be able to get us some statistical studies looking at all the different comets and trying to learn the various differences. As with anything, it's very hard to learn a lot about one type of object by studying just one of them, because that's a very biased view. It's like trying to understand humanity by looking at one person. And that won't give you a complete picture. But when you can start to study more and more of these objects, as as we likely will over the coming decades, then we can learn more and better understand a comet some of these objects that have been known since ancient times, but are just now being able to be looked at up close. So that was our picture of the day for November 28th of 2021. It was titled a high cliff on comet Sheryumov Gerashmenko. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be stellar pinwheel. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.